So it looks like Naruto and Sasuke versus Obito is well underway. Everything is going crazy and the hype is just too much to handle right now, if I'm honest. Guys, let me know how much were you freaking out at this point in the show and how were your feelings towards Obito at this point and his mindset about the kind of hopelessness of this world? Let me know. As always, guys, if you want to see the full length uncut early access versions of all these videos, I do have a Patreon. The link to that is down in the description below. But guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and let's get it. The boys. To go, to go. It's so sick. They're like moving together. Look at this for scaling, man. Holy shit. Oh my. So Hashiram is the only one to have seen this. Holy shit. Look at that. What? Obito, like. You, you try and act cool, but come on, man, really? You know that you're kind of scared a bit. Come on. Oh? They're sharing vision, right? Well, the same plane, so he's seen this. You know you are a badass when you pose like this, and then your feet come off the ground and you start floating slowly. It, it, is, a, it is a Don move. What the fuck is that? Damn, there is something kind of alluring about that. I'm not going to lie, the way they visually presented it. I love that color around Naruto. I'm not just saying that. It's kind of fucked, right? <laughs> Kakashi's just sitting there just like, I'm sick of this shit now. I just want to go to bed. <laughs> I mean, that is crazy. Now, how, I mean, but like, how insane can a blade get though, you know? So is that Naruto kind of calling them to action? <laughs> that little like little grunt by Sasuke is just like bitch please of course I will alright bet oh here they come Yo, oh, holy shit, what? Oh, best girl. Oh, my, this looks nuts. Come on, show me best girl, though. I want to see best girl in it, though. Yo, who would have thought Ten Ten would ever get this powerful, you know? Who thought she'd ever be shown on screen for more than a second? Come on, Shikamaru. Oh, fuck. Damn, look at this, man. Now, is this to create the opening for these two boys? Yeah, how powerful is Obito's sword here? Oh, that transition. Oh, oh look at them all young. Kurenai, too. This is powerful shit, man. Damn, this, he's just thinking about what could have been or how things could have been, turned out, you know? Oh, you're getting blown away. Oh, did they miss? Oh, they took a chunk. Wait, what was that? That is that it? Wait, no. Don't tell me that's it. Obito's like, oh, did I fuck up? The silence too. Ah. Uh, it's the other tailed beast, man. Uh, are they be trying to f f flee? Hell yeah. It's true. 
But that's the thing with uh, Son Goku, right? That was a really big moment because at the time it felt like, why do you care about this one? But you think about how much it meant because that showed all the beasts. And the thing is, they could have just thought this kid's crazy, but they believe in him. The tail beasts have awesome like voices as well. There was like, whoa, my <laughs> so the thing is it's crazy like some of the tail beasts look sick and then some of them just look like dead pokemon you know like how badass is that too many names to remember man i know that they uh they made a song about it but I don't know if it was, you know, a big deal to know them all. Here, guys, make some room for me, man. Oh, here we go. Come on, man! Come on, man. I'll help as well, man. Makes sense. Oh, can he help? Go on, Gara. I mean, you gotta better get your ass in there and help. Can't lose. Yo, is this gonna be enough? Like, surely Obito's gonna have to try and do something. He can't just stand there, can he? Yeah, I think I think Obito is starting to fucking worry now. Mm. Yeah, let's move. This is crazy, man. It really feels like the tides are genuinely changing now. Like, of course, normally we have these moments where, like, it looks like it's about to be a dub. And then all of a sudden, the, the villain does something and then it's hopeless again. But this genuinely feels like this could be the turning point. Bless him, man. <laughs> <laughs> I remember back when I watched that Kakashi Gaiden thing. And I remember just thinking, like, this is awesome to learn about all of this. But who would have thought that it had this much of an impact on the show? Like it was core to the show. See, Naruto even there feeling for him. So yeah, he can see all of this. Uh-oh. Don't tell me this is going to... Ah! All right, here's the gang. Look, it's everyone, man. Hell yeah. I love this music. Holy shit. Yo, like, I get when people say, like, the scaling is a bit over the top at this stage in Naruto, and that's why they got put off it. But I love it personally. Like, remember back in the days where, like, a kunai was, like, a big deal? Yeah, me neither, man. <laughs> He's like, Yo, go, wait, where's my guys? Hell yeah. I love those transitions. Of course he does, man. Like he could, he could, that could have been a reality for him. Yeah, he's stepping to you inside your head. It's very true. That's actually very true because it's like you didn't throw it away. You're still here, bro. Yeah, 
damn, I love this fucking show, man. Please don't tell me he's going to talk no jutsu the way out of this, though. I, I want this to go down. You know? <laughs> oh, that face. <laughs> oh, 